Hello everyone, welcome to today's session on uh, camera calibration with MATLAB and Simulink. This is Afnan Ahmad. I'm an application engineer at CES. It's an exclusive partner of MathWorks in Middle East. Uh, the aim of the session is to provide a clear view of uh, camera calibration techniques that are being uh, used to improve the quality of images captured with the camera and how MATLAB products and interactive app uh, that has the capability to do so and that can help us during the process of calibrating the camera and to estimate the calibrated parameters. Camera calibration is the first step in any machine vision workflows that has to estimate the parameters of video camera that could be for removing lens distortion or could be for estimating the depth of a scene or measuring optic dimension to uh, for reconstruction of 3D scene. So let's get started with stereo vision. Uh, it's a process of extracting 3D information or recovering the depth from the camera images from multiple uh, 2D views of the same scene. By estimating uh, geometric parameters of the camera, it is helpful in the computation and to design the 3D point cloud where each 3D point correspond to the pixel in one of the images. So let's get started with today's uh, workflow. The very first step is to calibrate the camera. And once you have the camera that's calibrated, we need to extract some parameters. That is how our camera is looking at a particular object with respect to the reference. And once you have these parameters, the calibrated parameters, uh, and you have extracted those parameters, you can start with the live acquisition of the scene and apply those extracted parameters to the scene and rectify for any errors. So once you have those undistorted images by applying calibrate, calibrated parameters, you can further proceed with the calculation of disparity map or the uh, pixel difference map. This is to know what is the difference between the views of a camera for a specific object uh, or a scene. That's basically a disparity map. So, and once you have this disparity map, uh, we can put everything together to design a 3D point cloud. To add to this, 3D point cloud is uh, heavily uh, used in autonomous driver SSS system uh, for applications like collision avoidance, collision detection, and also uh, odometry when you are surveying a geographical location to understand the area of the geographical location, it is possible through odometry and point cloud application. So MATLAB provides uh, interactive apps to perform the camera calibration. So let's go to the app tab and explore the calibration app uh, we have. So search for camera and they will find three different uh, calibration apps that is camera calibrator, LiDAR camera calibrator and stereo camera calibrator. So we'll be exploring these two uh, apps that is camera calibrator and stereo camera calibrator. So let me just open this uh, camera calibrator. So basically, why uh, I'm, I'm, I'm in, like, I need to go with ca calibration apps. So you can automate the detection of uh, checkerboard and the calibration process by using these apps. And this is going to simplify the uh, workflow instead of uh, you to solve and extract the intrinsic and extrinsic parameters of a camera. You can make use of these uh, apps to simplify the workflow. And also it removes the effect of uh, lens distortion from the images. So for a, a better result, it is recommended to have uh, between 10 to 20 images. So let's go and import the data uh, what we will be using to calibrate the camera. When I go to uh, add images, there are two different options to import the images. Uh, that is to import from a file or to capture from a cam. To go with this particular option, you need to have uh, an add-on or a support packages for the MATLAB. That is, you go to home and you will you go to MATLAB add-ons. So just, let me just scroll down. And yeah, this is the one. 
MATLAB support package for webcams. So you will need to install this for you to uh, if uh, to capture the images with your cam. And let me just go back to my calibration app what, where I stopped that. I have uh, already installed, like I have pre-installed that 